I don't mean to brag. I don't care, but I want you to know double vaxxed booster flu shot. And I'm going to be honest. I have the shingle shot too. And I still get my period. What? Yes. Traveled, went to Mexico twice, did shows, meet and greets, never got COVID. Clearly, Jesus loves me the most. Seriously. So nice. So nice. Um, so I'm in the emergency room. I look weird. Oh my God. I'm so, 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 so sorry. I passed out on stage. I got up, I did one joke and I felt so dizzy. You can see my eye, I fell on my eye. Oh my God. I can, I cannot believe this happened. I feel so terrible that they had to tell everyone to leave and then cancel the second show. A Tempe, I will be back. I, I've never ever fainted in my life. Eighteen, a big year, lots of milestones, like voting for the first time. But not just for anyone. Sean Caston is working to pass real gun reform, like universal background checks, to protect our neighborhoods and our classrooms. He's fighting to make sure that women can make their own healthcare choices. Sean Caston, my congressman, but I just call him dad. This morning, we're learning more about how Illinois Congressman Sean Caston's teenage daughter died. Gwen Caston was found dead in her room on Monday. Caston's family says it appears she died in her sleep, but an exact cause has not been determined at this point. 17-year-old recently graduated from Downers Grove North and planned to go to college at the University of Vermont. In a statement, the Caston family says, in part, the only thing we know about her death is that it was peaceful. And the only lesson we can take from it is to savor the moments you have with your loved ones. Apart from being a supermodel and married to a global mega pop star, Haley Baldwin is plenty of other things besides. One of them is being a healthy lifestyle enthusiast. In numerous interviews, Haley has shared her healthy eating habits as well as exercise routines. Haley revealed in Women's Health UK Going For Goal podcast that to maintain her best shape, Pilates is her go-to workout. On a regular day, Haley would jumpstart her day with eggs or oatmeal. Some type of healthy protein or a smoothie is also the kind of breakfast she would usually go for. Um, hello. hello. Queen. This is so fun and weird. Like, we've been in front of so many different cameras together. I know, it's I know. It's crazy. Okay, anyway, what are you wearing? You look incredible. very scary incident on March 10th. Basically, I was sitting at breakfast with my husband, having a normal day, normal conversation, and we were in the middle of talking. And all of a sudden, I felt this really weird sensation that kind of like traveled down my arm from my shoulder all the way down to my fingertips. And it made my fingertips feel really numb and weird. And I was sitting there and I was kind of going like this, trying to figure out like what the sensation was and where it was coming from. And Justin was like, are you okay? And I just didn't respond because I wasn't sure. And then he asked me again. And um, when I went to respond, I couldn't speak. The right side of my face started drooping. I couldn't get a sentence out. Everything was coming out like, not even jumbled, just like couldn't get any of the words out. So obviously immediately I thought I was having a stroke, like a full-blown 
They did some scans and they were able to see that I had suffered a small blood clot, a small blood clot, a small blood clot to my brain, which they labeled and categorized as something called a TIA. I'm gonna try to put the definitions of everything I talk about under here so that I don't butcher it. Basically, it's like having a mini stroke. It definitely feels like having a stroke. I wanted to update you guys on what's been going on. Um, obviously, as you can probably see from my face, um, I have uh, this syndrome called uh, um, Ramsey Hunt syndrome. And it is from this virus that um, attacks the nerve in my ear and my facial nerves and has caused my face to have paralysis. As you can see, this eye is not blinking. I can't smile on this side of my face. This nostril will not move. So there's full paralysis in this side of my face. So for those who are frustrated by my cancellations of the next shows, um, I'm just physically obviously not <laughs> capable of doing them. Uh, this is pretty serious, as you can see. Um, I wish this wasn't the case. How can I say COVID-19 vaccines? Come on, baby. Come on. Breathe, baby, breathe. Come here, master. Come, and my son, yeah. Can you get enough to the job you are? It's okay. Come here. It's okay. Come here, simple. It's okay. Can you shoot, shoot, stop, stop. to record. Huh? I'm allowed to record. No, you're not allowed to Why not? Well, That's highly inappropriate to do that. How's that inappropriate? <laughs> السلام علیکم بھائی جان یہ دیکھیں یہ تقریباً بارہ یا تیرہ سال کا بچہ ہے تو اس کو کال زبردستی ویکسین لگائی گئی ہے اسلامیہ سکول وحاری میں یہ دیکھیں 
इसके लवाकिन से पूछते हैं क्या किया गया इनके साथ बिल्कुल ये ठीक थे कल ये स्कूल में गए हैं इनको ज़बरदस्ती आए हैं वैक्सीन लगा के गए हैं ये ठीक थी काम कर रहे थे घर में अपना होमवर्क और अचानक इनकी डेथ हो गया ये वैक्सीन की वजह से बिल्कुल तंदुरुस्त थे कोई मसला नहीं था और अचानक इनकी यह डेथ हुई वैक्सीन की वजह से ये देखें प्राइम मिनिस्टर इमरान खान साहब ये जो आपने यानी कि वैक्सीन का सिलसिला चलाया है ये इस पर ज़बरदस्ती लगाई जा रही है 20 साल से कम उम्र के बच्चों को मेहरबानी करें प्राइम मिनिस्टर इमरान खान साहब इन बच्चों के फ्यूचर और इनकी जानों माल की हिफाजत करें